love I love Consola and Mayor. My name is Casey McGregor. This is my first time speaking before you. I am a small business owner of a salon that you called non-essential and you did this without apology. I mention this because I had to find a way to survive without any business income. Now you are proposing a 6.85% increase in property tax. 6.85 while we are in a recession. Then I asked myself, why the increase? Is it for safety and infrastructure? Not according to what was written in the Post Bulletin. You want to add more staff. A human resource position. No. When you encourage businesses to stay closed, we had to figure it out. So I say no, figure it out. Increased travel and training. No. You encourage lockout of our kids from school and told them to learn from Zoom. Now you can take your own advice and learn from Zoom. No more trips on the taxpayers. Zoom it is. Mm -hmm. Budgets for staff and elected officials. No, we are in a recession. How much staff is still working from home, by the way? Mm -hmm. Heating and cooling. The county put in a new furnace. Why did you not do the same? Because you want something bougie that the taxpayers cannot afford. This is like living in some kind of elite Martha's Vineyard dystopia right now here in Rochester. Nothing mentioned in this increase of 6.85% goes to crime, drugs, or sex trafficking. Where's the important stuff? Nothing mentioned on what people on fixed incomes do. What happens to seniors? Nothing mentioned on young adults. How will they ever be able to afford at home here in Rochester? Or are they supposed to just be quiet and enjoy densification? Groceries are up 8.5 to 9.5%. The increase is going to go up 10 to 11 for the USDA. Gas prices are up. Home heat will be up this winter. What do you want the rest of Rochester living across the street at the warming center? Hmm. Are you recession deniers? Why is the government refusing to accept any inconvenience while the people who elect you hmm. that you serve go without? Do you, do you hear how hard it is for families right now? Or do you live in your own echo chamber and ignore the people you are meant to serve? Thank you for your time, and please note, vote no on the increase of 6.85%.